TikTok, what is good, man? And today we got a little, we got a little encouragement Bible verse today. I'm gonna be reading from 139 14. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that very well. I'm gonna read it again. 139, Psalms 139 14. I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Your works are wonderful. I know that very well. So what I'm, so what I'm meaning in this, in this right here is this. God made you fearfully and wonderfully. He made you perfectly and wonderfully in his image. So whenever people say negative about you, whenever people say, hey, Trey, you're ugly. Hey, Trey, you're not this or or something negative about you. Don't let that phase you. Don't let that get to your heart because you know what the word of God says about you. Stop. Just stop letting anybody say anything about you. Because you know what the word of God says about you. You we see as Christians and as people as well, this could be for non-believers as well. We need to change the way we think. How are we going to reach that goal or that, that we want to reach? How are we gonna reach that the top we want to reach if we're letting the negativity in our mind bring us down? We we can because the word of God says we are fearfully and wonderfully made. God says we are a warrior. God says we are a fighter. God says we are beautiful. God says God says we are we are we are we are free. He set us free. Jesus set us free by dying on the cross. God says we are a conqueror. God God says we are all these wonderful things. Why are we letting the enemy tempt us? Why are we letting the enemy bring us down when we're not none of what the enemy says? It don't matter if, if you know, it, it doesn't matter who says anything negative about you. You know what the word of God says about you. God says, I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made you. Your works are wonderful. I know that very well. I know that. I know that. I know that full well. Start declaring who you are in Christ over yourself daily. It's time as Christians that we rise up. We got to stop letting people say any old, any old thing about us. Because it all starts in the mind. It's a mind battle. It's a mind battle. It's a mind battle. We're supposed to set the example of of how Christ, of of how of who Jesus Christ is in us. We're supposed to sit, we're supposed to show the world that light of Christ in us. So everybody is not going to like us. Everybody is 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 not going to be on our side. But that's okay. That's okay. Let God's will be done over your life. Because I decree and declare days will get better in Jesus Christ my name. For everybody watching this video, God is about to do a mighty thing in y'all's life. But in order for him to do that mighty thing, you, you have to believe. So I, I just encourage y'all, get in the word of God. But the word of God says, God made you perfectly in his image. You, you, I mean... The word of God says it. God says that. Your creator says that, man. Your creator says that. You don't need no girl to tell you that. No boy to tell you that. No person to tell you that. No. God says that. And when God says, it's enough. Because God can fulfill your peace and give you a peace that is satisfying. That's eternal. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life, man. Not, 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 not porn, not, 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 not no relationship, not, not, not no, not no drug, not no drink. No, 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 Jesus. Jesus. If you, the Bible says, if you seek him, all those things, like, like, I'm not talking about the worldly things. I'm talking about the things you want, that relationship, that job. That YouTube channel to go, all that money. Matthew 6 or 3. Seek him, everything else will follow. Yeah, yeah, you heard what I said first. I said, I said, seek him. I didn't say seek that. I didn't say seek money. No, I said seek Jesus first. Everything else will follow. So I encourage y'all, man, stay in his word. But y'all don't need nobody else to tell y'all who y'all are, who y'all are in Christ except Jesus. Our job as a body is to lift everybody up. But what God says is enough. What God says is enough. So I, so I just encourage y'all, bro. Stay in God's word, man.
Because God made you fearfully, wonderfully, perfectly in His image, man. Y'all have a God bless day and peace, man.